Introducing Sora. Ever imagine typing a story and watching it come to life? With OpenAI Sora, the typed words transform into stunning videos. Ready to unleash creativity? This is like getting wings to the dreams. Dive into the future of storytelling with Sora, and let's find out more about Sora. OpenAI has introduced a new AI model named Sora. This model is a text-to-video generator, which means it can create videos from text descriptions. It's like having a movie director who can instantly turn the script into a video. So actually, what is Sora capable of? Sora can make videos, that seems very real. For example, if the user tells Sora about a woman walking on a Tokyo street at night, it can make a video of it. Imagine a woman in a black jacket, long red dress, and black boots. She has a black purse, sunglasses, and red lipsticks. She walks easily and boldly down a street that's bright with neon lights and moving signs. The ground is wet and shiny, so it looks like the lights are doubled because of the reflection. There are a lot of people walking around her. The user can tell Sora what they want in a video, and it will make it. For example, if the user says a cat playing with yarn, Sora will create a video like that. AI is like a smart computer program that learns and can do human things like talk, write, or create art. OpenAI makes AI to help people and be safe. Sora is really smart and strong. It can make short videos, up to a minute, that looks just like real life or whatever the user describes. It can also make cool videos, like a dragon flying or a bike race on water. Sora can make videos look like 3D, cartoons, or real, and even add sounds and music. So, what is the current state of Sora? Sora isn't ready for everyone just yet. OpenAI is letting some people try it out to spot any issues and improve it. They're also teaming up with artists and movie makers to create new kinds of videos. OpenAI hopes to learn from their experiences and find out how Sora can inspire more creativity. Sora is really cool and powerful, but there are some challenges to overcome. Sora needs to understand what people type and make the right videos, but sometimes Sora could get things wrong or not understand correctly. Another thing to work on is making sure Sora's videos show respect of all kinds of culture and people without being unfair or hurtful, along with the positives. There are many possible problems to be addressed. Sora could be used to create videos that aren't true. For example, someone could make a video with Sora that shows a celebrity doing something they never really did. This could spread lies or damage the celebrity's good name. Also, Sora could be used to make videos that make things or break the law, like violence. This could harm or take advantage of someone. OpenAI knows about these problems and is working to stop them. They're doing things to ensure that Sora is used properly. For example, they're putting special marks on the video from Sora, so people know they're made up. They're also putting warnings on the video to tell people about what Sora can do and can't do, and the possible dangers. Plus, they're keeping an eye on videos made with Sora to stop any that are not okay or hurtful. In simple terms, Sora is a new technology that can make videos from words. It is made by OpenAI, a company that makes artificial intelligence tools. Sora is very advanced and powerful, but it also has some challenges and risks. OpenAI is testing and improving it, and they're trying to make it safe and ethical. Sword surprises the industries and the world, and it has a lot of potential to change the way we make and watch videos. So how does Sora create these amazing videos? The steps are. Understanding the prompt is one of the main things Sora should do. When you give Sora a text prompt, it first analyzes it to understand its narrative and visual requirements. This means it tries to figure out what the text is describing and what kind of video should be created based on that description. Sora uses the diffusion model to generate video. So, what is the diffusion model? A diffusion model starts with a frame that looks like visual static, which is like a fuzzy, grainy image you see on an old TV when there's no signal. Then, it gradually refines this image over many steps guided by the prompt. This means it slowly transforms the static into a clear, detailed video that matches the description in the text prompt. To handle videos, Sora first compresses them into a simpler form, similar to summarizing a book into a few key points. It then uses visual patches to represent different parts of images and videos. These patches help Sora understand and generate diverse visual content, such as scenes with various resolutions and durations. Generating the video is the next step. After understanding the prompt and preparing the initial frame, Sora starts generating video. It does this by drawing from a vast dataset to create the corresponding video. This dataset contains many different images and videos, which Sora uses as a reference to create its video. Sora doesn't just create a video in one go. Instead, it refines the video over many steps, making small adjustments at each step to make the video look more like a description in a text prompt. This process is similar to how an artist might start with a rough sketch and then gradually add more details until they have finished a piece of art. Will the final output be amazing? Definitely yes. The final output is a video that closely matches the description given in the text prompt. 
This video can be up to a minute long and can look very realistic, like a scene from the real world. Or it can be imaginative, like a scene from a fantasy story. OpenAI Sora, a text-to-video AI model, has made significant impact on its rival in the industry. Here's how. The tech world is always in competition, so there will definitely be rivals for Sora. The introduction of Sora has intensified the competition in the AI industry. Other companies including Google, Meta, and various startups are also developing their text-to-video models. The race is on to create the most powerful and versatile AI tools. With the arrival of Sora, a new set of standards is being placed as benchmarks. Sora has set high standards in terms of video quality, coherent, and visual details. It can generate videos that are up to a minute long and have high resolution, which is a challenge for its rivals to match. While startups often bring innovative approaches and agility, OpenAI, backed by large funding from companies like Microsoft, has the resources to quickly catch up and potentially overtake its competitors. Source launch has changed the dynamic of the AI market. It has raised the bar for what's possible with AI, pushing other companies to innovate and improve their models. Surely, the coming of Sora will be a huge influence on future developments. The success of Sora could influence future developments in the AI industry. Other companies might focus more on the text-to-video models, seeing the potential in demand for such tools. If Sora proves to be superior to its rivals in terms of performance and versatility, it could potentially dominate the market for text-to-video AI models. Sora's introduction has significantly affected its rivals by intensifying competition, setting high standards, changing market dynamics, influencing future developments, and creating the potential for market dominance. This is a testament to AI's transformative power and the ongoing innovation in the field. Is Sora the only AI model that can make videos from words? No, there are more. Gen 2 is one among them. This model, made by Runway, can also create videos from text prompts. It uses a GAN, similar to stable video diffusion. Gen 2 can make videos with a resolution of 256 by 256 pixels and handle some simple prompts. However, it cannot make videos with sounds, music, or voiceover, and it often produces low-quality or unrealistic images. Google has also introduced one, the Lumiere. This model can create videos from text prompts, use a similar approach to Sora, combining transformers and diffusion models. Lumiere can also make videos with sound, music, and voiceover. However, Lumiere has some limitations compared to Sora. It can only make videos with a resolution of 512 by 512 pixels, and it cannot handle complex or long prompts very well. Deep Art and Deep Dream comes next. These are two AI systems that can transform image into artwork. They use a technique called Neural Style Transfer to apply the style of one image to another. However, they mainly work with images, not videos. DALI is also a great rival for Sora, but the real case is that it's also an AI developed by OpenAI, the same organization that developed ChatGPT. DALI can generate images from text description. It's quite powerful, but it's designed for images, not videos. Sora unveiled. What if your imagination could instantly come to the screen? OpenAI's Sora is about to change the game. The revolution in video creation is just getting started. Will you be ready to bring your visions to life? Comment your thoughts on this. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe.